because everybody's inviting and friendly, and uh, the vendors are great. The band, the lineups, everything's awesome. Bourbon and Beyond has wrapped up yet another year at the Highland Fairgrounds, and it's safe to say that the fans that set a record for the festival are going home happy. You're watching Wave News at 11. I'm Noelle Friel. From a scorching end of summer to a rainy start of fall, Kentucky weather did little to drive away music fans this weekend. Wave News reporter Alina Noakes has a look at how those fans are feeling as Bourbon and Beyond comes to a close. Imagine going back in time to 1961 and then right back here in 2024 all in the same night. Well, that's the experience fans at Bourbon and Beyond got rocking out to the Beach Boys before ending the night with one of Kentucky's own artists of today, Tyler Childers. So between Bourbon and Beyond and Louder Than Life, it's the biggest eight days of music in America, really transforming the city of Louisville into a musical destination worldwide. That destination, the Highland Fairgrounds, where 60,000 music fans broke attendance records for Bourbon and Beyond's sixth year in Derby City. Zach Bryan was amazing. The Beach Boys are freaking on fire. Kicked back in lawn chairs or clustered in at center stage for the legendary Beach Boys, the festival brought in fans from all over the nation. That's awesome. We brought three couples of friends with us and got a house and we're here for the week. My name is John and I brought my family and we're having a good old time. Family first, remember that. It's not about money, it's about memories. Make out of moments you beat with people you love. All making memories at the biggest bourbon festival in the world. It's really rooted in all the things that we love, um, which is bourbon, uh, great culinary, um, amazing music, and most importantly, the people of Louisville um, that have just welcomed us with open arms and continue to support us. People like this crew here, faithful festival goers and always with a cup of bourbon in hand. A perfect day to be able to kind of put in costume on and come out and, you know, be yourself. Be a little more what you like and express yourself like bourbon express themselves and like people here express themselves. Louisville's great and weird because of that and that's why we love it here. As Bourbon and Beyond retires until 2025, the work begins overnight for the event to close out September louder than life. It's America's loudest festival um, and we're really excited to be celebrating our 10th year. So we'll be working around the clock to ensure that our loud mouths get an amazing experience. The event space will completely transform for the rock and roll lineup, a place Keegan Ward won't recognize when he returns for his eighth Louder Than Life festival with his dad. It just means the world to me. He's the one that got me into the music, my dad. Sporting tattoos like this one. My entire back is a patch wall of people I see. And hoping he'll find his inspiration for the next one. Louder Than Life kicks off Thursday, same place and same time with its first headliner of the weekend, Slipknot. Alina Noakes, Wave News.